$1,500? There's no way I'm paying that. Sinead, water bills have outraged hundreds of people in DeKalb County. Some of them say that they've seen a jump in costs from hundreds of dollars into the thousands. When I saw a bill like this, I'm like, there's no possible way that this is even remotely correct. From what you've seen in the news to possibly what you've read on your own water bill, some DeKalb County residents have experienced higher water bills for a variety of reasons. But while the cause of each isolated issue is determined, the Cab County government wants you to know that we are aware and are working to continue to deliver on our ongoing promise of quality service for all county ratepayers. Absolutely, we care about our customers who are taxpayers, who are residents of DeKalb County. We're concerned about your issues. Uh, although I stated that it's a small percentage of challenges that we found, um, that's one too many. And until we rectify the challenges that we have on our side, we're gonna continue to uh, uh, not cut off water uh, while uh, there are bills in dispute. So interim CEO Lee May issued a moratorium on the disconnection of water for bills in dispute, and the county sprang into action, launching a full-scale, comprehensive billing dispute resolution program. If you've received an abnormally high water bill, your first step is to contact DeKalb's Utility Customer Operations Team. Good afternoon. Thank you for calling the Cab Utility Customer Insurance Hotline. How are they speaking? May I have your customer number or service address you're calling about? The newly established Utility Customer Assurance Team has been assembled to handle water bill disputes. The team will hear your concerns, review your account with you, provide you with tips on determining the possible source of excessive water usage, walk you through how your meter is read and your bill calculated, and assure you that your disputes will be investigated. And what I'm doing, I'm, I'm looking at your history, I'm looking at your account. I do see that um, your normal bill is around $200 a month. And what I would like for you to do is to pay your average bill and you won't be subject for, for any disconnection or, or anything such as that. At this phase, the assurance team will mark your account as contested in the system, send you a formal letter acknowledging that your account is in dispute, and provide you with the rate you will be required to pay while your account is under review. The rate you will be asked to pay until your dispute is resolved is an average of your rate for the six billing cycles or 12 months prior to the contested bill. At this point, the assurance team will send a contested charges work order to the Cab Watershed Management's field services team. It is important to note, you may continue to receive disconnection notices during this time. However, once your account has been marked as contested in the system, your water will not be disconnected as long as you pay the average rate amount provided based on the terms of the moratorium. Right here shows 240 rereads. All work orders are tracked, assigned, and reviewed here by DeKalb's watershed management team. This is where a technician is dispatched to your home if you've disputed your bill. The technician will reread your meter, check for leaks, and if desired, meet with you, the homeowner, to discuss your billing concerns. While in the field, watershed technicians will work to determine a number of critical elements pertinent to your account, including if you have an older brass meter or the newer iPearl digital meter. Currently installed in 70,000 homes, the new digital meters are part of the county's ongoing mission to ensure accuracy and eliminate the possibility of human error. All homes are scheduled to have the new digital meters installed within the next four years. It's a digital meter. There are no moving parts. It only works on the magnetic flow of water going through it. So if no water is going through it, no reading should be processed. And this is a touch read. So you have to actually touch right here to read it, and it will give you an accurate reading of what your water usage is. Back out in the field, the technician will assess the field conditions of your home and check for possible issues leading to your increased build using this field service verification form. Upon completion of the technician's assessment, the checklist and results are sent back to the utility customer operations team. If the team determines there was an issue with your meter's reading, your bill will be adjusted accordingly. 
If there were no issues found during the reassessment of your meter reading, you will be required to pay the bill charges. However, county staff will work with you to determine ways to reduce your water consumption and establish a payment plan if necessary. The county wants to make sure that we're billing you accurately for the water usage. We don't want to bill you for something that you didn't use because we, we realize that even though we're the only one supplying water, you're our number one customer. And we want to make every customer feel special and know that we appreciate you. In addition to increasing the rate of which all residential meters are changed out to the new digital meter system to enhance accuracy, DeKalb County also remains committed to ensuring transparency and is working to retain a third party entity to review escalated billing disputes. Other solutions include upgrading all water meters to use the Profield Forest Workflow software, implementing the use of FlexNet to proactively monitor all meters and automatically flag reporting errors, and integrating a new customer portal allowing residents to have direct access to their meter readings and regular consumption numbers. That's exactly the mission of this enhanced, trackable, and efficient billing dispute resolution program. From the teens in the field to the representatives on the phone, DeKalb County is working daily to resolve issues with our current system, communicate updates regularly to residents, and improve the equipment, software, and overall process for the people of DeKalb County. And that's a commitment which defines this watershed moment for the quality of life here in DeKalb County.